Hello, I'm Jo from Mummy, and recently I was very, very lucky to be sent some gin to taste. Now, anybody who's a mum knows that gin is the thing that is going to get you through motherhood. Well, it is for me, and it appears to be most of my friends as well. Anyway, back to the gin rather than surviving motherhood. Well, it was this beautiful bathtub gin here. Um, I'm just going to grab the bottle. It's from Abelfurt, and it's got quite a distinctive bottle. I don't know if my camera can zoom in a little bit on that. The finish on it is almost like a brown paper bag wrapped with um, quite, I suppose, ancient string at the top um, and then your nice cap here. It really stands out in the supermarket. I think that's probably why I have picked it up in the past. I'd be lying if I didn't say I'd already tried this gin, but I am quite a gin fan, so you know, what am I to complain? Anyway, so I was lucky enough to be sent some bathtub really to give some honest opinion about. And I've got it here served my favourite way, and that is with tonic and ice, obviously. And with this gin in particular, I love orangey. It just blends so, so well. It's got quite an, a smell of, I suppose, citrus fruits and cardamom, and it goes incredibly well. Um, with lime but orange is certainly my favourite so first of all chin chin I'm just going to taste it just to remind myself how it tastes yeah still tastes good but I might have to finish this glass shortly just to remind myself um, but yeah as gins go it's really really smooth I have to admit that I've had it uh, neat with ice and it is just as delicious and one thing that we did um, over the weekend was we made some gin and tonic sorbet. Never made gin and tonic sorbet in my life, I have to admit, but decided that, well, now's the time, I've got this beautiful gin, let's see what else we can do. You've obviously got your usual cocktails, but you now summer is approaching, let's see what else we can do. So our gin and tonic sorbet's got a hint of lime to it, and maybe I should have tried it with orange, but we did lime, and it is to die for. So I'm going to add the recipe below for you as well. That is, that is better than any ice cream you will ever, ever taste, bathtub, gin, sorbet. So definitely worth a try. So if you're looking for a gin to try over the summer months, perhaps when we're outside barbecuing, or even the winter months when we're sat inside wishing it was summer, I can definitely recommend that you try the bathtub gin. As I say, as a mum, three children, all my friends seem to drink gin, but if you're going to drink one gin this summer, perhaps you should try bathtub gin.